This is amazing. My taste buds are about to explode. You're stoned. You're stoned. I'm stoned. <laughs> You're all stoned, Jesus. I wish dessert wasn't so bad for me. Yeah, well, these days everything's bad for you, even the good things. So you might as well do what you want, otherwise you're gonna die out of boredom. Or smoking. At least I'm not getting fat. <gasps> so you think I'm getting fat? No, I'm saying that since I smoke, I stay skinny and I don't have to go to the fucking gym all the time. Well, maybe I like going to the gym. Maybe I like smoking. Maybe I like guys who don't. What's that supposed to mean? Exactly what I said. I would prefer it if you didn't smoke. No, you said that you prefer somebody else who doesn't smoke. Whatever. There's a colossal difference, Lauren. A smoker or a non-smoker. Going to the gym or not going to the fucking gym. They're two radical opposites. So? So why don't you say it? Say what? Say it like you said it before. What you prefer. I don't know what you're talking about. Tell him. The opposite. Why I'm about to explode. Tell him how you wish I was more like him. Jack? No. You need to hear this, Peter. You're the main cause of our arguments. I'm sure that Lauren's filled you in on all this, Julie. How she wants to contort me like some clay puppet into something that's exactly like our movie star over here. <laughs> it's not true, Jack. Stop regurgitating dubious bullshit from your easily deceived mind. Then explain how my easily deceived mind heard his name, not my name, his name. On January 14th, 11.04 p.m. last year, coming out of your mouth while my dick was fucking you. Explain that, honey. 